Jesus. Man. Off balance again. I'm gonna take it though. I'm taking Okay, fellas. I'm actually doing a workout now. Basically, uh, got a little treat for you guys. Something that I've been thinking about for a while and I wrote it yesterday. Um, I'm going to throw it up on the screen there. And basically, it's a new program I'm going to be running for a little while. I'm testing it out. You could try it too if you like it. Um, so basically, I just named it Scorpion Death Drop Full Body Training. Uh, just because I wanted something that was... Quick and effective. Sting's my favorite wrestler. His finishing move, Scorpion Death Drop. It's quick, it's effective, and it looks good. Um, so basically what the program is, is I found for lower body, since I've been doing Bulgarian style, Wisconsin method, Bugenhagen style, um, legs progress really well. Um, I've been doing Bulgarian split squats for almost two weeks now or something like that, and I've been progressing every day. I hit 290 today. That's my all time, even though sketchy on the left leg, I kept losing my balance, which was aggravating me. But anyway, what I'm getting at is, I don't feel like I'm gonna get injured or snapped up or anything doing legs like this. Um, and I think it works really well. Now, when I was doing it for upper body, I felt like I was, I, I felt like I was gonna get snapped up. I felt like I was gonna get injuries. Uh, my shoulder was bothering me, my elbow, blah, blah, blah. So. <laughs> I was thinking, what can I do? Because I really don't want to neglect my other body parts. And so, because I like to train every day, uh, you got to keep the volume low. So intensity is going to be high, volume's low. And when I see my best results, I was doing full body programs. Um, I've done every program in the book. I did bodybuilding style split for a long time. You know, chest, arms, back, legs, shoulders, whatever. Um, my best results came when I was doing full body. Uh, basically, every other day or every day I'm gonna do is combine these two programs so I'm, so I'm gonna combine Bulgarian and full body and the way that I do that is I'm gonna do Bulgarian for legs or your heavy compound lower body so trap bar deadlifts deadlifts zercher squats squats split squats whatever lower body thing you're gonna do Bulgarian okay working up to a heavy one after that though and and honestly guys I know you're thinking oh it's gonna take forever it takes me about 20 to 30 minutes to work up to that single and then you're done, you move on, right? You're not doing back down sets or whatever. You can if you want, but I don't do that because if I wanna keep progressing, I need to keep my volume low. This is the breakdown of the program, right? It's very simple. You're gonna do Bulgarian or Wisconsin method for the first exercise. That's your lower body compound. Then you're gonna do one exercise for your arms, be it biceps or triceps. So if you do biceps today, you're gonna do triceps tomorrow. You're not gonna do them on the same day. So for me today, I'm gonna do a bicep exercise, it's gonna be an incline curl. Then I'm gonna do a vertical push, which is up, right? So we're talking about a deltoid press. I'm gonna do a Z press, okay? And then I'm gonna do a horizontal row. I'm gonna do a seal row. Then on the following day, you're, uh, you're gonna follow that same exact setup. You're, you're gonna change the change the plane for the exercises, right? So I did biceps day one, day two, I'm gonna do a tricep exercise. Then, because we did delts the other day, I'm gonna do chest. That's a horizontal push. And for me, I'm gonna do weighted push-ups, and I'll show you how I do this setup. And the third exercise is going to be a weighted chin-up. That's a vertical pull. So over, this, over the course of two days, you've hit your legs, then you've hit your arms, and you've hit pushing movements in vertical and horizontal, and you've hit your pulling movements in vertical and horizontal, okay? Everything's done. Now, all you're gonna do is follow a simple progression model, right? Because you wanna keep these workouts around an hour max, guys. Honestly, like, you don't wanna be working out all freaking day, and is it even beneficial, right? Probably not. So, so all we're gonna do is we're gonna do two max sets, right? So on the bicep, let's take the bicep curl, for example, right? That I'm gonna do today. I'm gonna do, we're not counting warm-ups here, guys, okay? We're talking about, I'm gonna do two heavy sets and I'm shooting for a rep range of seven to 10. Why seven to 10? Because I always like going seven to 10. That's just what I enjoy, right? So I'm gonna do two sets shooting for seven to 10. Now, if I get, 10 reps on both sets, the next the next day I'm gonna, or the next time I do that exercise, I'm gonna bump it up, 
okay? If you don't, let's say you only get two sets of seven, right? Perfect. The next, the next workout, you wanna shoot for two sets of eight. Not two sets of 10 and seven. I'm talking about if you only get seven, go up one single rep. So two sets of eight, shoot for that. You get that, go for two sets of nine. You get that, go for two sets of 10. When you hit that, you start it all over again. Really simple, guys. Now, another thing that I want you to focus on is we're not changing up exercises every single workout, right? You're gonna pick six exercises, really seven. You're gonna pick seven, right? So you're gonna pick your leg exercise for Bulgarian, get it out of the way. Then you're gonna pick one exercise for delts, you're gonna pick one exercise for chest, and you're gonna do one exercise for buys, one exercise for tries, and then you're gonna pick two back exercises, but one of them has to be a pull down or a pull up, and the other one has to be a row. That's it, guys. When you stall out, for multiple workouts in a row on any one of these exercises, that's when you sub in the exercise. That's when you swap. Pick a new exercise. Or if you're just getting bored, if you're sick of it, you're not feeling it, then swap. But don't be swapping every other workout because how are you gonna gauge your progress, right? So I'm gonna go through this first workout today and I'll let you know how it goes. Thanks. Shit. Oof. <laughs> 